hi everyone welcome to my channel so today i'm going to show you how i cut my own hair i've been cutting my hair for the last what 15 years <laughs> yeah because in 2005 i went to to school like for hairdressing to learn how to cut the color like that so i'm i'm really pleased that i could do it for my own hair and for my friends and clients so you need the brush the brush and a two hair ties or hair clip if you have and this scissors and, um, I mean this is a thinning scissors and normal scissors here like that a comb <laughs> and a comb so so I'm this is very easy and everyone can do it especially if you want to do a, a layer haircut so um, my hair is really dry so I'm going to because I am growing gray hair I have so many white hair so often like three weeks to four weeks or even a month I have to um, dye my hair to cover gray hair so so it's very dry because of that so let's brush my hair so this is what it looks like at the back of my hair <laughs> as you can see it's very dry <laughs> I'm in Norway and I did not have my hair straightener with me so I just tried to brush it nicely so now it's a little bit softer than how it was so the first thing to do is to brush it this way take your time I hope you guys are enjoying my videos <laughs> so I've just only started and I'm still learning how to actually how to use the YouTube and it's actually really quite a lot of fun to be on YouTube especially like I love what I do and I want to show you more beauty tips what I do face mask and, and more on makeup how to become a makeup artist, etc. How to travel with children and so on. So, so brush it like that. Supply, brush, brush, brush. So, <laughs> and, and then grab your hair tie. One. It's okay. <laughs> so these are all my hair. <laughs> it more <laughs> and grab the next hair tie this one lapid na matapos I'll finish soon this is so easy so I wanna cut more hair mm, I have to do this one or my chin you can go shorter if you prefer but I prefer to have a long hair so this is just to trim my hair I'm gonna show you closely I have some really damaged hair at the tips yeah so I just want to remove them because so you need to trim your hair at least like four weeks to six weeks so So 
So this is about um wait. Mm. Like two inches. So I'm going to trim my hair today this much. Like just two inches, you know. I, I really prefer to keep my long hair, so so like this, grab your scissors, here we go. This is a the uh, scissor is the normal one, not the thinning one, so it's like this. <laughs> Are you ready? <laughs> One, two, three, here we go. <laughs> so this is my hair. It's so thin. My hair is so thin, like really thin. Yeah. By split ends. This is all my damaged hair. So after that, <laughs> use your thinning scissors. Um Thinning scissors to give a bit of texture and to give a bit more like style. So grab your comb <laughs> or your brush, depending on you. So like that. So never drop your scissors because when you drop it, it won't work the same way again. That is one. I'll do another one. Comb it again to blend a bit, and then get another section. Take your time. It is your own hair, so you just wanna make it like really nice for you. In France, uh, when you go to the salon, it's like. Um, 80 euros to 100 euros to get a haircut so this is so easy you just need to buy your own uh, scissors and materials and tools that you need to be able to cut your own hair so another one don't be afraid if you messed up or you know, you cut your hair in a wrong way because, you know, the hair always grows. They grow back. So that's the one. <laughs> this is so much fun. I love cutting my own hair. And I color my own hair too. So the next step would be this scissors, like point cutting. I'll show you. So, because um, it's a little bit thick, I will section it in two, like this, comb your hair, and do that, I can't see, like this. <laughs>
I've lost a lot of hair and my hair is so dry and I don't have a hair straightener here but I will curl it so you can see the difference from before um, this is what I did you can go sh shorter if you want to so just have some fun and experiment if you want to cut hair very very quick i can't stay too long doing this thing everything must be quick especially when you just had a baby and you want it to have And you know what? My hair feels healthier this way after a trim. Because usually the end bit of the hair is very tortured and very dry. So I'm so glad that I'm able to cut my own hair. Everything are close here in Norway. And I don't think anywhere I'll go to the salon. It might be really too, too expensive. Like more than a hundred euros or whatever so this is this section <laughs> for watching it's a lot of fun for me this is all for you so if you don't know how to cut your hair <laughs> you can follow these steps what I do and if you have questions you know how to reach me And be careful when you use this curling tool. If you're not used to this, you can get burned, easily get burned. It's very hard. I set my wand to 220 degrees. So I'm using this uh, hair tongue equipment for more than three years now. I bought this in Abu Dhabi at Madi International. And I like this a lot because it's good for long hair. So, let's see. Next time I'm gonna cut my hair again. I'll make sure to record it for you. Maybe next time I have a different kind of idea what kind of hairstyle but usually i really prefer to have a long hair like this let's see how it's gonna look like guys i hope you like this kind of method to how to cut your hair it's very easy so simple so all you just need to do is to take your time and be patient so please if you like this video just thumbs up and share to your friends or subscribe